text from my dad earlier this week with the simple words of, Want an adventure? I, of course, said yes and found myself driving to Indiana to the public library of my dad's hometown. We pulled out the microfiche for the June 1975 newspapers. Dad was looking for the coverage of an old case he worked on. After we found what we needed, we took a scenic little detour through downtown, stopping at the famous Shemp's Confectionery, pulling up outside my dad's childhood home and neighborhood. He was having so much fun pointing out houses or alleys that he remembered from his youth. I had to smile at his enthusiasm. I could tell he was happy to tell me these stories, but even more so to relive them himself. It got me to thinking about the past, and I remembered all of these photographs we found last year of my dad's family. Now you might remember from a previous vlog, I like the past, and thinking about what people were doing and thinking. There is so much to learn. I look at these pictures and it amazes me that these people were my family. Most of them passed away years before I was even born, and yet these pictures remain. Some are blurry and out of focus, but so is life. Did my grandparents, my great-grandparents, did they know that I would one day be looking at their pictures and wondering about their life? I know they couldn't even possibly imagine I would make them into a video and put that on the internet for all to see. These concepts would be completely foreign to them. So what about us? These videos we make and put on YouTube, will our grandchildren look at them one day and wonder about us?